Hey folks, AWR Hawkins, Breitbart News. I want to talk to you real quick about the fact that the New York Democrats have shown their hand and in so doing, they've given us a clear look into the next phase of gun control. You know, for a decade or longer, the boilerplate for gun control among the left has been a quote-unquote assault weapons ban, a ban on quote-unquote high-capacity magazines, universal background checks, uh, firearm registration. Come lately, it's been, of course, red flag laws and other things. New York has all of those. New York has all of those. Now, New York Democrat lawmakers are pushing the ability to sue gun makers because the shootings in New York City have not gone away. Matter of fact, they're surging. Not only are they pushing to sue gun manufacturers, they're pushing for drug tests before you can legally purchase a gun. In other words, making it harder for legal purchases to take place. They want a drug test before you can legally purchase a gun and a mental evaluation. Both of these things before you can legally purchase a gun. Of course, that'll be in addition to background checks and all the other things that are commonly necessary to legally purchase a gun. Folks, this is what we've said at Breitbart for years and years and years, that gun control is insidious and that when they get gun control in place, it leads to more gun control, right? And that's what we're seeing in New York right now. All you have to do is read the headlines. This isn't conjecture. This is what is happening. What? Can, that's a good question. Can I, can I still eat a poppy seed bagel, then purchase a gun?